Greetings, kitties. Pennywise, the dancing clown here, to review Hydro Thunder for the Sega Dreamcast. Now I know what you're thinking. Where's PC? Isn't he the one that normally makes videos on this channel? Well, that's normally true. He's a bit indisposed at the moment. Being the nice clown that I am, I decided to take a break from eating little children to help him out. Nothing to fear, kids. Pennywise is here to fulfill all your Dreamcast reviewing needs. Anyway, back to the game. Hydro Thunder. I really like this game. Mainly because you can float. <laughs> sure, there are many Dreamcast games where you can float, like Alien Front Online, where you can shoot those little light beam things that make your enemies spin and float in the air. It's, it's so fun. Oh, and Wetrix Plus has those little ponds with the floating duckies. I love those little duckies. They're so cute. The little ponds just floating there. Hydro Thunder, though, is the best floating game on the console. Sure, you can race around the tracks and beat all the other boats, but I just like to sit there and float. It's so calming and peaceful. Just floating there, doing nothing else, just floating. And floating and floating. There's nothing better than coming home from a hard day of work in the sewers and popping in your copy of Hydro Thunder and just floating. In conclusion, I highly recommend this game and give it five balloons out of five. Go pick up this game so you can float too. You all float! <laughs> Be sure to subscribe.